Hello, I am Dr. Marasi Agrawal. Today I am here to clear some myths about PCOS which is very common condition in reproductive age group. So, the first myth is PCOS is a very rare condition. No, it's not a rare condition. It is affecting millions of women. In Asia, it is affecting 2 in every 22 women. It is a primary cause of infertility in reproductive age group. So, the second myth is you will know for sure that you have PCOS. No, it's not necessary that you can get it known that you have PCOS. There are many symptoms of PCOS that can happen with you like acne, irregular periods, some hirsutism means unwanted hair. These all symptoms are due to hormonal disbalance. It can cause some long-term health effects like psychological problems, overweight, obesity, diabetes and depress depression and many things. So one myth is, if you are not looking to get pregnant, you don't need to worry about PCOS. No, it's not like that. PCOS may affect your long-term health. Like it may cause you obesity, overweight, depression tendencies, diabetes, psychological problems, dating drowsiness, mood swings and even cancer. So the myth is, PCOS can be treated if you lose weight. Yes. If you lose weight, you can find some good results in PCOS but the thing is you need to take some medical drugs also for treating PCOS and also you have to change your dietary habits. So what can be done to reduce the long term risk of PCOS? So the first thing is what I would recommend, do exercise daily. At least 3 times a week if you do exercise daily, it is going to improve your PCOS. Another thing is eat proper food with a regular interval, not like uh, eating a lot of food at a time. The Another thing is eat a lot of protein diet instead of carbohydrate. That means replace your carbohydrate diet with protein diet. Protein is going to improve your glucose metabolism like eat eggs, meat, pulses and also whole food like whole bread, whole cereals that is going to improve your dietary habits and uh, the PCOS symptoms.